welcome back guys to another video and today we're at an abandoned wedding venue it's slightly trashed but it still has uh, quite a few things inside clean mirror so yeah <coughs> it's quite dusty as you can see I've had our eye on this one for quite some time as well. And um, now there's no security on the, at the minute. We thought we'd take the chance to have a look around. Still the old tap. This is behind the bar. It's just stuff everywhere. All the old pumps. I used to connect to the barrels. There's another lift as well. Right, so the floor is very, very slippy. There's just oil everywhere. Obviously the kids have been in. Yuck, look at that. Kids have been in. And, uh, yeah. As I was saying, the kids have been in the chucked oil everywhere. You can actually hear mice as well. Check this out as well. Cookers. I don't know where the mice are, but you can hear them clear as day. I think they're in the in the walls. Look at the grills. This is a crazy. No, you can't even go around there. You're gonna have to walk the other way. Let's see what this is. So it's stuff. All right then. Restaurant. Quite nice. Shame it's a bit trashed. Yeah, shame it's being trashed, like. So yeah, it was a wedding venue and restaurant, guys. Um, also, hotel. This way to the bedrooms. And then we we'll come through to the reception area. And that's where you'd walk through. <coughs> Another bar as you'd come through the entrance.
Because it says pull, but there's no handle. Oh yeah, that was the bottom of the stairs. But they've uh, barricaded it. I don't fancy climbing all over that. But you can get up there. Just have to go up the other way. Yeah, get a better view of view the uh, view of it from here. So coffee beans everywhere. Oh can smell is just coffee. Nice little fireplace. Still loads of stuff up here as well, like phones and stuff. Dog friendly snug. And then the fireplace has come through. Baby changing room, accessible toilet. So yeah, I think this would have been part of the restaurant. Or maybe like the bar area. Go inside this. Maybe the manager's office. Yeah, look at all that. It's crazy. Absolutely crazy. It's a shame as well because there's actually um, private paperwork here as well of um, previous parties and weddings that have happened here. Obviously, that's confidential. But. <coughs> I'm starting to think this place was actually busy. <laughs> it's a long time since I did my research on this place. Like I said, guys, it has been closed down for quite some time now. And um, I've not actually been able to get here. And now, obviously, just done a check on it and it's got no security on it. So we thought we'd check, check it out. Great Republic. So I'm not sure what all the clothes are about. Bit of a different one. It's like shows or something. You never know. Some nice mirrors about. Loads of camp beds, spare beds and stuff like that. Heaters, ironing boards. I'm guessing this was just a star room. Got another one with a therapy chair in. Look, every hotel always has. A Bible. New Testament of Palms. Quite a few of these rooms are trashed. So, some of them we may come to are trashed and others might be okay Weird how the windows slant outwards I 
And that's another room. Everything's been trashed in that one. And that would have been a nice mirror. On the table. Like gold. Looks not proper gold, but looks nice. And got a nice four post to bed as well. It probably was from inside this room. Check that out, it's pictures of people that may have stayed here before. Still coats. Why is there so many pictures left behind? I don't get it. Surely if you come to a hotel, you won't leave your pictures behind. But there again, there's a lot of clothes here as well. And through here, there was another four poster bed, but it's been trashed. These would have been for weddings and stuff, I'd imagine. And as all hotels, most of the rooms are repetitive. So I'm not going to go in all the rooms. I'm going to go down. Go down here. And then I'm going to take you in a few more rooms. And then we're going to go down. Back down to the restaurant and the other parts. <coughs> this would have been one of the double rooms. Out there, you had a quite a nice view. The Humber Bridge. So most of you will probably know where we are, but it's trashed anyway. So by the time this video is probably released, hopefully by then it'll be bought. You look like you just seen a ghost. Really? Yeah. We're going this one. Yeah, oh, another one that's trashed. Four post to bed. Shame, really. <coughs> right, so we're going down into the restaurant. I think you have to go through the back way. Yeah, you have to go through the back way. Oh, no, you don't. Look on chairs. Oh, just no need for the damage at all. It's a shame. Now we're going to the washroom. Even uh, aerial as well. In the storeroom. Everything's just been dashed everywhere. Extra chair storage for when obviously you had events on. All the Christmas decorations. The chairs could have been sold and everything. Right, we're gonna go into the restaurant now. This would have been like a conference room. Well, they could have had smaller dues.
and then that through here is where we started. So now we're going to go outside and we're going to go to the other cabins and uh, take a look at them. But first, just going to have a little uh, quick look at the pond. Imagine staying here. It does look quite nice as well. Just a shame the kids have obviously been in and damaged the place. Imagine coming out here in the morning and having that as a view. As well, guys, if you are liking the video, make sure you smash the like button and give it a share. And uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I bet there's fish in that pond as well. Right, let's go check them other buildings out. Look at all the Christmas decorations. They could have been given to charity or something. We got quite a few decorations as well. <clears throat> Security jacket. It's a shame, really, because a lot of this stuff, yeah, could have gone to a uh, charities. That's a beautiful picture as well. Check that out. That, uh, a green bike for when they did the, what? the green bike for when they, they painted all of the bikes. I think it was when it was Tour de Lincoln, was it Tour de France or something, but through England? I don't know. It was ages ago. I just know the paint, yeah, look, there's another one there. They painted them all green and hung them up. Look at all the furniture in there. This place would have been crazy when it had been fully furnished. I'm, I'm actually shocked that none of this stuff's been actually auctioned off. I'm actually shocked. There's some actual nice stuff in there as well, like furniture and could have gone to charity. Loads of furniture as well. There's also loads left in the inside the hotel. So yeah, this would have been one of the suites. how nice it is. Why is that all it looks nice? like all this stuff here would have been maybe community service. Because look, one of you guys says community payback, unpaid work. So that's uh, these would have been the cabins, and I think people who were uh, on probation would have done probably the gardening and that. Yeah, let's go take you around these cabins, these other ones. Another suit, a Buckingham suit. Lift rooms. So yeah, this would have been a quite a big hotel, this. Wedding venue, restaurant. Got quite a biggish car park. Looks like it's a quite a lot of work done before it closed down don't look all that old it's a shame really that it's been trashed hopefully one day it will be reopened as what it has been used for so guys we're just coming another bit yeah 
We can't get in this door because it's locked. And there's cat shit and cat balls in this part. We like another part here. So we're going to take you around. And uh, just don't know that's behind reception. I'm going to go check upstairs first. Uh, I'm going to check downstairs. I think these are just empty rooms. What? These are crazy, what are they for? That looks actually not for a play. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. It said that the other person there that shows. So maybe it was like for uh, kids, because there is a kids diner. Kitchen. Just to tear up. So, coming in into the like family diner. It's a bit more laid back for kids. Look at them walls as well. Kids would have loved it here. It's not wacky warehouse, but they've had a lot, a lot for kids. They've got little things here as well. Football table, pretty minute football tables as well. High chairs. Very cool then. Welcome to Fingley's restaurant. And then through there, you've got a load of high chairs. I think this would have been for breakfast. It looks like a breakfast bar. You got all your cornflakes, all your jam. Being like all you can eat for breakfast. Have a nice view of the lake. So guys, we uh, found a mannequin. We found a hard hat and a high vis. We made a security guard. So yeah. There's no, there was no point in us really coming in here. Um, this is obviously one of them cabins. So, yeah. So yeah, security's look watching. <laughs> security's looking. Mm -hmm. So cheers guys for watching today's video hope you've enjoyed it make sure you give it a like give it a share and uh if you haven't already subscribe to the channel subscribe to our tiktoks and uh also give us a follow on uh well follow on tiktok and facebook so yeah we'll catch you on the next video and uh yeah Cheers for joining.